Hey, what's going on everybody? Wanted to uh, make the Sunday video real quick. Um, so it was really cool last night going to uh, your mom's place and seeing the guys from Rear Naked Choke. Really cool to get to meet a band from North Carolina that I've been working with for uh, like over a year now. Got a record deal. Those guys did out on tour doing killer things. Rear Naked Choke, great band. Also got to uh, see uh, Chout. A uh, really, really good band from Chicago. Met the guys from Texas 223. Be talking to them as well. So it was really good to get out. Um, this video, uh, I wanted to tell you, it's kind of important that all of you know this. Um, promoters in your town, wherever you live, anywhere in the United States or Europe or Russia, wherever you're at, promoters are screwing bands. Everywhere in the world, it happens in every city, in every country. So, I wanted to give my personal recommendations. If you're here in Oklahoma City, Jim Shiel at your mom's place, excellent to work with. Uh, Bill Stonehead, also another great one to work with. Lauren Cheney, uh, excellent, great people to deal with. Um, if they're not any of those people, I probably wouldn't work with them here because there are bands that I have personally been watching for 10 years, uh, playing the same bars for the same promoter, going nowhere, getting nothing done. Uh, and that sucks because there's a lot of amazing bands and a lot of amazing talent that deserve better things than they're getting. Um, and that is, that's in large part to the promoters because when you get talent, you share it and you push it and you make things happen for them. That's what I do. That's what I would do for them, even though they all hate my guts, um, which is ridiculous because I want the best thing for them. Anyway, so uh, those are the people here in Oklahoma that I think uh, you should deal with. And lastly, on a very sad note, with this whole uh, shooting thing that's going on, I'm watching the news today, and apparently if you're white, now you're a white nationalist terrorist. That's what they're calling, calling us, or calling the people that did this. Um, so here's here's my plan. Don't shoot these people that are shooting other people. Take them alive. And take that guy who said he doesn't like Mexican people and drop him down on 29th and Shields in Oklahoma City and see how long he lasts. Those people that want to go into black churches and shoot people, don't, don't kill them. Don't put them in jail. Drop them where they're going to get some good treatment. I promise you the shootings will stop. When they start finding the body parts of these people, they're having to pick them off the sidewalk. They don't deserve jail. They don't deserve to be dead. They deserve to be get what they gave. So, I don't know. I'm not a politician, but I think you put it on pay-per-view, and then you take all the money that you raise for putting, you get Dana White to put these people in a ring with, you know, the people's family, and all the money that you raise, you donate it to the families. You raise some money, and you give these scumbags exactly what they deserve which is a beating with a garden hose. And, and I don't even want to get into that, so. Uh, God bless us, man. Uh, let's, let's, like, love each other and take care of each other, man. This is the shooting. It's just stupid. All right, gang. I'm the Moose. Metal Coffee. PR. I'd love to work with your band. Don't worry about my politics. It's just I'm angry. I'm not a terrorist.